Hey guys, this is Peter, and I had a conversation with my kids about, well, Christmas cartoons. And they said, well, what's the best one? And I said, oh, hands down, Spirit of Christmas. And they had never heard of it before. This is what kicked off South Park. And they said, oh, yeah, South Park, yeah, that's old. I said, no, no, Spirit of Christmas was the very first episode. It's actually before the episode. Call it a pilot. Five minutes and 15 seconds, this video went viral because uh, 1995, no one had ever seen anything like this actually before or since. This is really a action-packed five minutes and 15 seconds. I did find it online. Here it is. It is an AVI file, which means it's old. <laughs> and let's see, five minutes and 15 seconds. It's not even 640 by 480. So it's really kind of pixelated. It needed to be small. We had to send it to each other. This was before YouTube. So uh, there it is. And um, what I wanted to do is update this. I talked about a piece of software and that was the video proc converter. Excellent piece of software. I've used this for a long time. It will allow you to convert things from like AVI and make them, well, modern once again. But now we have some AI tools. So I'm gonna be able to, well, boost the resolution of this thing. And I've already gone ahead and done it. So uh, this, this program will actually help you record a screen in fact, it'll even capture you with your uh, camera and put you in, so you couldn't like YouTube with it. Basic, basic uh, level. Uh, it'll set downloader, that's fantastic. The DVD is a ripper. And the video converter will allow you to convert file types of all different kinds. Here, I'm gonna go to the toolbox and show you that it will denoise, deshake, merge, trim, split. These are great features. Sometimes you just capture a video or you have a piece of video and you just need to trim it in the front and the rear, and just make it a really nice little package. Sometimes you want to get rid of some of the noise or some of the shake that's involved, like with the GoPro camera. It'll do all of that. Music types, it understands them all. You can convert from FLAC to MP3, whatever you want, or the other way around. Uh, all the different devices, you can actually make it create different file types for all the different devices so it's the right resolution and all the different, different video codecs. Uh, MPEG-4, <laughs> H.264, and uh, M uh, WMV, and all the different formats. MPEG-2, DivX, H.263. Wow, there's some old ones in there. But um, that's what we need. We need 3GP was what I used to shoot with, with the cameras for the kids. And yeah, I can grab some old stuff and make it new again. Here, let me just show you a picture real quick because you can grab pictures, super resolution, boost it in. Take a quick look at this. This is a good picture. And I'm gonna show you the reveal here. Good picture, this was the original picture and you can see the reflection of the photographer, that's me, uh, in the baby's eyes. And look at this, it just cleans this up. But check out what it does to Spirit of Christmas. So I wanted to show you that because my kids said, I can't watch this video. Look, it's too small. And they're right. It is really small. And this is it stretched out. And it becomes super pixelated. And this is really what we have to do deal with. But, you know, these guys are big now. And no one wants to see this come back. So I just could I've never seen it since. So this is the original. I've, I found it on a, a zip drive, believe it or not. And uh, here it is. Look, it's just pixelated. And and goofy. Now we know all these kids now. This was brand new. We had never seen these kids before. But of course we recognize Kyle, Stan, uh, Kenny, and Cartman. You know, these are household names now. But in this 1995, we saw this Christmas card come out and it was hilarious. They are foul mouthed little kids. They swear 22 times in this five minutes and 15 seconds. But it is in a uh, 512 by 384 format. So it's AVI. And it's not even good enough to, to watch, really. So that's how big it is on my screen. Blah. That's not big enough. So here, I can even open it, of course, with, with anything I want. Let's see. Open with. Do we have that option here? Open with. And of course, I can open it with the VLC player and bring it down to its... Yeah, you can see it's exactly the same. So I'm going to convert it and make this way better. So there's a there's the picture of what we're seeing now. 
There's the boys, and I'm going to show you clean it up. So here, super resolution. I'm going to drag in the footage. Let me just bump it up. I'm going to take this up as high as it'll go. So it's going from 512, 384 up to 2048. So halfway to 4K. But don't worry, you can feed it in there multiple times. So here, let's just jump a couple seconds into it and see what we got. Look at that. It just cleaned it up. So this is the original, and this is it cleaned up. Watch, it'll display it twice, and then it cleans it up. Boom. Here's the boys. Look how clean that is over on this side. That is so much cleaner. Boom. Look at that. That is so clean. Here, and we can actually adjust it to be actual anime. And it does a super job. It's really good with animation. Look at this. It'll do work great, great with your home photos, wedding photos, wedding videos, that kind of thing. Look how clean that is. It went from this to this. Let me just jump in a little bit more. Boom. Look at that, how clean that is. Again. Boom. Look at that. That is just super. So, yes, you see it takes one or two seconds. That's exactly what it's going to take when you do the whole movie. Drag it in, click the run, and it will... Uh, it doesn't look like it needs to be de-interlaced, actually. Looks like it's pretty good. Oh, look at that. This is perfect. So what I did is I ran it through once, but of course you can run it through twice. I'm going to open it up right here. And tw uh, what did I say? Tw 2048 by 1536. So here it is. Oh, and I, now it is. Now it's a good looking. Of course, you know, it has to make up text that wasn't even there. But now I can read this. 1995. And as we jump through this, everything just looks so tight. And it is a much, much bigger, better production. Everything looks so clean. Brian Bortano, that's the first time we saw him. It's Jesus versus Santa Claus. It is hilarious. This is a really, really great one. But look, I can actually close this down. And I can feed back in the output of that. Because it only took it to 2048, halfway to 4K. Super resolution. I need boom, bump it up. And it started out really cloudy, but now this is the input is what I was my last output. But look at this. I think it still does a cleaner job. Ding. I don't really see it on that one. Ooh, this one should be good. Yeah, that is indeed cleaner over here. This is a cleaner image than this. Watch this. Not a huge difference, but just kind of like a milky lens kind of thing going on. And this is already after it's been up uh, upscaled. So we're upscaling it again. So the t final result is going to be full 4K. That's outstanding. So of course you just click run and it will make that double. But I gotta say, this has just been fantastic. This is one of the coolest tools I've seen. It has been part of my toolkit for a number of years. It is a recorder, it is a downloader, it's a DVD ripper, and it's a video converter. Video converter is pretty darn cool all by itself. You can trim things, you can t pull out the noise. In fact, there's a whole toolbox here. You can merge things, that's really great. Some of the earlier videos, you, once you de-interlace them, they were shorter because, well, video was just different back then. You can actually grab a couple and put them together, merge them together. It's really a nice feature. Um, a lot of great tools here. And I like the, let's see, there's a D-Shake. A lot of your original uh, GoPro stuff might have been quite shaky. Look at this. For, for audio files, whether it's AAC or FLAC, we never really knew what was going to happen when it first came out. Everyone thought they were wanted lossless, but we turned out to be MP3 was pretty big. But then there was so many different levels of MP3. I think we finally ended up, Apple kind of set the, the tone with 128-bit. Uh, but uh, you could have all these different formats and just move them back and forth. This is a cool toolkit. Different devices, you can set it up for resolutions. Different videos. We have MPEG-4. We have H.264. Uh, there's even an H.263, there's MPEG-2, there's DivX, there's the... Th what was the one that I had with my 
my phone. 3GP, I know it speaks that one well. That's in here somewhere. Where is it? Do I have to go down here and click this? Because I know it does a 3GP. In fact, I've brought them in. I'm probably just missing it because I am shooting a video. <laughs> H.263. There you go. MPEG-1. MPEG-2. FLV. I forgot about that one. There is a ton of stuff that this thing will do. And NTSC. WMV2. VP8. DivX. I forgot about DivX as well. But yeah, those were all standards of the time. There was so much shakeup. There were so many different versions. But this one will help you read in just about anything and output all these different file types. So I know it'll take in a 3GP and bring it out uh, other different ways. Pretty darn cool. This is a great tool, but now it has three new tools. These are the, uh, your AI, your artificial intelligence. And as I said before in my other video, these are amazing. However, don't think they're gonna be incredibly fast. It's one or two frames per second, up to 10 frames a second if you have a super processor and video card, but uh, it just cleans things up. I, I, let's see, I have a picture. Here's another one. Let's grab this one, throw it in here. Watch this, just clean it up. Boom. You can just see, that's a good picture. But watch it just get a little bit better. I had another one that was here that was pretty darn good. I have it, right? Is it on this one? Yeah, this folder. Let's go ahead and grab this. Now this is kind of neat because this one is my background. So my son and I went to the beach and look at the sand. The real sand is has some great texture to it because it's a beach, it's sand but I kind of like the effect that it does. Look at the rocks in the distance. Look at the sand just go clean. That is cool. I love that little detail right there. Because those cliffs, those cliffs are wet in the background. Look at the, look at the ocean. It's just cleaning this up. Those waves just actually get a little bit cleaner. So yeah, is it that more reality? Yeah, but I kind of like the effect of just a clean beach. That's pretty darn great. Anyway, guys, this is a cool program. It will allow you to take things you can't change. South Park, the original one, Spirit of Christmas, they aren't going to be redoing that. I've never seen anybody uh, make it into 4K, but now I've got a copy because of Video Proc Converter. Cool little program. Take a look at it. I'll put a link below. I'll also put a link to the video that I did last week on it. Definitely worth having in your toolkit. Um, cool little program. There you go, guys. Hey, I just wanted to show you Spirit of Christmas because I got to enjoy it all over again. And um, I'm just going to hit that open. There it is. Boom. Boom. These are fantastic. The quality of this is just off the charts. Anyway, guys. Hey, if you like this, give it a thumbs up. And I'll put a link down below. Merry Christmas to all of you. I'm going to put a link to my favorite things on Amazon. Go ahead and take a look through it and um, hey, put something in your cart if you need something for yourself. <laughs> See you in the next one, guys. Talk to you soon.